Table of the Games, I'm Nehru. And I'm Rode. And we have just defeated the Color Dungeon in Link's Awakening. And we're going to Martha's Bay to go to Catfish Maw. And at the Color Dungeon, I picked the Red Tunic. And that gives more power. I have uh, the power, piece of power with the sword right now, so I'm just overloaded with power. So please like, comment, subscribe, share that video, tell us what you think in the comment section. And uh, we're going to hop right in the video, running around, running around like a clown in town. You may notice our audio is slightly different today. We are using a different capture card. And to say that it has been a nightmare is not even given it justification. Sorry, Road. Everything that came with it did not come right. So we are jimmy-rigged on a setup today as I have ordered new cables to replace what was supposed to come with the device. It's supposed to ship with the USB-A to USB-C cable. It ships with the USB-A cable. It's supposed to be a three-foot cable. It is exactly a one-foot cable. So, our audio may be a little higher or it may be a little lower. Because I've had to jimmy rig this. And, uh, it's a little sketchy. But it's going to work today. Danger Nato got you. Yep. But we're going to be, uh,. Running around doing a few things and eventually make it here to the Catfish Mall. Should I look for seashells or mm. just go in there? Whatever you would like to do. It'd be easier if I had the. How many seashells do you have? 15? Oh, we'd have to find five. I'm gonna just hop in. That's quite a bit. Want to go in? Yeah, might as well. Once you get the, uh, I think it's the hook shot on this one. Yes. That'll make it easier to find some more seashells. Level 5, Catfish Mall. Oh, <coughs> Turn around. And the Helmosaur is a pain in the butt. Helmosaur. I like them. Well, that's what they're called. Oh, yeah. They're helmet sores, you remove the helmet, and then they're just sore. <laughs> and then they're just sore. But this, yeah, because you kicked their butt. It is what they are called as a helmet sore. That's cute. I just want to kill it. Yeah, whatever. I only know that from tons and tons of Twilight Princess. So unless they had a different name for them way back in the day, but it, they've always been home the source. Cute little creatures. Annoying as all can be. Dude, just turn them around. These ones don't charge you. Got the compass. Now you can see where the chests and nightmares are hidden. This compass has a new feature. It's home. Tell you the keys hidden in a room when you enter. Okay, good, good job. I need some hearts. Ooh, oh, now I need a feather. Lattice feather. Oh, I remember when you doing this on the Switch. Yeah. This wasn't easy on there either. Nope. Nope. Oh, come on. Oh, 
Oh, got it. Boop, 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 boop. Sparky, small panic. So this is the fourth room. They count it by these pillars here. Oh, okay. I was wondering how they were going to do it on this one. So I have to remember that. That's way back here. So y'all, I've been watching an anime on the side called, uh, Eden Zero, which is pretty good. It is by a hero Mishima. And uh, you can always tell his work because he always puts in this blue cat called Happy. Same cat from Fairy Tale. I'm about to say, sounds familiar. And the cat's always like comedic relief, but it also kind of like ties everything together. And I'm like, 20 or 30 episodes then it's pretty good. The main character is the son of a demon king. And he was abandoned on a planet by himself. And uh, Without giving out too much, the VTuber uh, who streams her adventures finds the demon king's son. Her and Happy bring him onto a ship, get them off the planet, what not, it's pretty good, it's actually worth watching, it's a recommendation. Oh, he didn't even talk, he just went straight in the kill, trying I to kill I thought say son. I did too. Don't you have to bomb his body? Yeah. Dude, OP much? Dang. Nah, I'm gonna die. Oh, got medicine. Crazy Tracy coming in clutch. Dude. Oh, man. What's going on? can't beat you, I'm out of here. Thank God. But yeah, I just started watching Eden Zero. Come and get it if you can, Master Skeleton Dude. But, I've watched all of Fairy Tale, which, Fairy Tale being the first one I saw, highly, highly recommend. Great anime. One of my fans in Neighbors Love had a uh, tattoo done because they loved the anime so much. I could totally see people doing that. I, I love the anime too. It is a 10 out of 10 recommend. It's one of them uh, good hearted animes. Ooh, ooh. Good dodge. Oh, what a weird object. There must be some way to tackle that. Obstacle. But I've been in between watching Eden Zero, uh, Archer, which I am now. Hey, you got a piece of power. Feel the energy flowing through you. I'm like on season six of Archer, which is pretty good. ISIS no longer really exists, they're private investigators. Working for the CIA. Last episode I watched, they were uh, 
trying to track down people who were in the MK Ultra program. Getting brainwashed and Archer tried to save a dude and he jumped off the building. And then Archer got waterboarded for the first time. So that was that was different. People always crack under the waterboarding. Uh, also watching Dexter and Supernatural. I, I like the red tunic. Like, you being way more powerful plus a piece of power. No, it's just a tease. So that's I remember to come back here and go underwater too. Yeah, the underwater portion is much later because you have to have the hook shot. Okay. I'm pretty loud. Dude, get away from me. I also am slightly watching World Trigger as an anime. I don't recommend it so far. I am seven episodes in and it has... Slow? It's slow and it like repeats the exact same thing so many other animes do that it's... Like I've yet to see something really unique about it. This sucks. Basically, the main character, well, there's like two main characters, but he hides his powers that he can battle like these creatures called aliens from like another world, neighbors, that he can battle them. So he gets the, the crap beat out of him nonstop, even though he could beat the crap out of other people. They just have him just constantly getting beat up. And then one of the neighbors... Uh, takes the form of a boy and he's trying to figure out why this kid let himself get beat up constantly and they're both covering for each other as a international organization whose job is to kill all the neighbors which is this boy is basically trying to kill him and it's so slow and it's very irritating Good job, you got it stuck. Well, that's new. I didn't know I could kill them with bottles. Jars. But their powers is called a trigger. And the triggers come from neighbors. You have the stone beat. So the, the power the kid uses to defend himself is from the things they're all trying to kill. They're constantly talking about the trigger. Like when I say constant, they don't go three minutes in the anime without saying the word trigger. 
Trigger, trigger, trigger. Pretty much how it is. And it's so irritating. I don't know if I'm going to finish the anime, but I may power through it just to see it. There's like three seasons. First season's like 12 episodes. Second season is 73. Netflix went all in on this. The room to the side, what you opened up back there, I believe that is the second uh, bomb room, if I remember right from the switch, where you have to go fight the skelly boss. Oh, man. But you're not really health-wise in the spot to do it. I'm still trying to make my way through the Murderville series. I've got two episodes left. It's so stupid. <coughs> it's a comedy, right? It's a comedy crime scene investigation. But it is very dry comedy. Like, one of the main characters is going by the name of Shitbox. Okay. And it's, there's really no good story to it besides the fact that they are just trying to make it comedy. Which it was like funny for the very first time they said it, but now that it's like two episodes in, it's like, okay, joke's dead. You got Fiddy Ruby. Very nice. to the right should be number two and then the one above you two and one over should be number three yeah I'm not gonna live have that faith of the heart in you John <laughs> Archer would say to believe. Arg, I can't be here. I'm out of here. Whoa. Told you you could do it. I'm still gonna die by this thing. Oh, maybe not. You need to go to the one above you. Sorry, I'm looking for hearts. Oh, I fully understand. You do you. I'm just saying where the next skeleton boy is. down here? Uh, that takes you to an area I think you need the hook shot. Yeah. But you can get more hearts and bombs potentially. I might keep repeating this room for a minute. That's fine. Just to get the one heart. One heart and two bombs. And that I needed that. Help. No, oh, it's probably going to go away, maybe, when I go down the... You could just go up and down. Yeah. Boop, boop. Oh, it's not cute. Aw. Oh, it saved it. Good. Oh, there went that art. Yeah.
retrospective, I think it's interesting that this game maxes you out at 14, where Switch will max you out at 20 hearts. Well, they updated things. me to go up oh. and you're gonna have to do the little pushy thing a few times and go to the other room and you need to go up again go up this room no go right push that to the right and you need to go up it's <laughs> so close you need to go up again And I believe uh, but you can uh, there's an enemy on the other side you can get to now the ball of hate. I know it is a ball of hate. You need your ball. Gulp, you found me. You're a real pesky kid, you know that? can't beat you. I'm out of here. And the fourth one is at the very beginning of the dungeon. Yeah. Got them both. And you got the dungeon map. Wow. I got all the way to the beginning. You can push that block, the one, like, straight across, go left, up and over, grab that pot, and you can. You can push that and cut part of your trip down. I don't know if it'll save you too much, but... Wow. I remember you doing that before. I have a good memory for useless information. It's not useless. It's helpful. You can get that hard if you want to work on it. Right. It's through here, right? Uh, I'd have to see the map, I think so. Yeah, it should be the one right through there. You go down there. It's either that one or it's up to, or right one up to.
Got him. Good job. And dead. Sling shot. Hook shot. Hook shot. That just opened up the rest of the dungeon. And opened up a lot of the world. Mm hmm. Oh, I forgot it pulls the items to you, too. Yep. Oh, I need to jump. Peace back. Piece of power. You wanna, yeah. Two hundred rubies. You're stacked. Dead back. He's fucking good. I think that, uh, pot is a fairy, if I remember, unless they changed it. They could have changed it. But that pot next to the hookshot area. Thanks, Road. Road coming in clutch. Can't push any of those, but you can go left. Man, I can't wait to watch you play. I'll probably forget it all by then. Small key, small key. Oh, I'm maxed out at 90, 999 rupees now. Is there anything worth buying? Nope, because I stole it. <laughs> <laughs> I stole the bow. There's a room where it was just... In, oh, it's probably a fat one. Yeah, that's what it is. So it's like, there's a room north of you, but I don't know how you'd get there. Nope. They look so much different on the Game Boy version. 
This is the Game Boy version. Well, I know, but I meant they look different here compared to the Switch. Are they gonna do anything? That's a baddie. On well, Switch, they drop fairies. They're not as forgiving. I should have went out of the way. When they shake, they go downward. I have to go underwater. Yeah, get those other two chests. Are you able to buy the item that you trade later on? I don't believe I am. I never really tried it. You want to go up? And up. Kill these guys and go up. Oh, well, I need to go to the water yeah, spot. Yeah, the water is a heavy one. Okay. You sure? Right. Water should be over around here. There's this water, and then there's the other water. The other water is ahead of you, too. Speaking of dead fish, we had a fish die today. It was my bottom feeder. He way outlived his expected life expectancy. Like, technically, he should have died in. 2019. He's a big boy. And he lived five additional years. Past what his expected life expectancy should have been. That area, yeah. So I need a small key and a nightmare key. Alright, I don't have the nightmare key. Yeah, you don't. It's in one of those two chest rooms, plus the diving rooms over there, too. Piece of power. Those are so annoying. Right, yeah, you want to go up again? Well, don't make me go the wrong way. I'm looking for that room that yeah, you go under the water. Yeah. not above me. That's it above is. me. Yeah, you have to go up again. Unless it's up there. It could be up there. You have two chests still to collect. There you go. Loopers!
Death to Goomba. When you jump on them, they get hearts. If you attack them with your sword, you get money. That's cool. What's funny is that guy was just stuck down there. You put him out of his suffering. <laughs> Nightmare key. Now I need to find the little key. Now open the door to your nightmares. Like that. that other area I still need to go is where you're gonna go. Oh. Move! Yeah, they are right on you. Above you and once you're right. Oh, it's video is very nice. It sucks it doesn't just close it because you're full. Here we go. Small key. Not many hearts. To the right and go down. Huh? Oh, to get out of there. Perfect thing to get just before you go to the boss. And you got a heart right there. Did I get that heart? You didn't go and get it, but it's coming. I didn't see it. It's in the pot. Oh, that? Yeah. yeah. Pretty sweet. Thanks. Awesome. 
fine. So you are the outsider. Oh yeah. Time to wake the wind. Fish. Hee hee hee, I shall eat you. Oh, I completely forgot he was like a little sneak dude. Dude, that tells us some damage. Come on, coward. Let's hit the wrong button. Yeah, I think you almost got him. Tis tis, you don't seem to know what kind of island this is. Kihi. What a fool, Kihi. You've got the win, Mer Meriba. Shrine, an island shrine. Alright, well, we're going to go ahead and call it an episode there, so thanks for tuning in. Please make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share the video. Tell us what you think in the comment section down below, and we will see you guys on the next episode. Have a wonderful day. Thank you for watching. Till next time, see ya. See ya, and peace.